What up, Scorpio, and welcome to my channel. I hope all of my Scorpios out there are doing well. So I've meditated through your cards, and I've shuffled through them also, and so I kind of got the overall energy of this reading. This is going to be a twin flame reading for the Divine Masculine or Divine Feminine. So let's get into this energy, Scorpio. So the first card we have here is Keys on a Ring. This talks about having many options. So I feel like in this twin flame connection, your twin had a lot of... A lot of options so you weren't the only person that this person was dealing with i feel like this person had some type of decision to make when it came to you and the other people that they were dealing with but i feel like this person they made a decision but they made the wrong decision then we have one night stands this situation could have started off like it's a one night stand or a friends with benefits kind of situation but i feel like you guys did not know that your twin was stringing you along and that this person has other had other options then we have addiction, codependent. So I feel like your twin, they were like in a codependent energy. It was like they kind of depended on other people to like validate them, to make them feel, you know, worthy, to make them feel good about themselves. You know, they needed validation. And I feel like this was someone who could have been obsessed with you guys because we have this heart. You see, I feel like this is someone who always wanted love, but I feel like because they had so many options, they couldn't focus on, you know, which option could lead them to love. You know, this person had some type of, of block, and this also could have been a controlling person. So this person could have suffered from, you know, addictions, also could have been healthy addictions, like drinking, smoking, things like that. But I feel like their most... The, the biggest addiction they had was that they were, like, codependent. I feel like you and your twin were kind of codependent on each other. So, it's like you guys kind of fed off each other and you mirrored each other in a way. And we have here talking, um, conversing more, a weighted message arrives, text, call, email. So, I feel like some of you guys, I feel like possibly you could be meeting someone new, someone who's going to spark your interest because I feel like, now that you realize that you were just an option to your twin, it's like you're going to kind of want to move out of that energy. So you guys could be meeting someone new that you can be conversing more with. Or I feel like if you guys have been waiting for some type of communication from your twin, that you will be getting some type of text, a call, an email, because it's on the computer. So I feel like if you and your twin, if y'all did a lot of communication like online, then I feel like your twin could be communicating to you online at some specific time. Then we have the Ten of Swords here. This could have been an air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. But I feel like with this Ten of Swords, your person has, like, closed out a lot of cycles in their life. You know, whatever that they needed to end, it was like this person has ended a lot of things. And I feel like this person could be to themselves at this time or spend a lot of time, you know, outside. Or you guys could be seeing blackbirds. But I feel like this person has spent a lot of time to themselves. And we have the Four of Swords. So I feel like this person has been resting a lot. Like, all this person does is probably go to work and come back home and go to sleep, you know? It's like this person's trying to take time out for themselves. Like, after closing these cycles and going through these obstacles and challenges, you know, it's been a lot for this person. So, I feel like this person's trying to find time to restore themselves and their heart. You see this heart is here? I didn't see it until I was getting ready to put this card down. I feel like this person needs time to restore their heart before they come towards you. So, this person has possibly gone through a lot and i feel like this person is ready to maybe tell you about some things that they possibly didn't tell you about in the past but i feel like this person they need time to restore themselves you know before they can come to you guys some of the, your um uh, some of your twins could have been married with this high armpit in reverse and i feel like some of them may have possibly went through a divorce um with this car being in reverse and maybe that's something maybe that's a cycle or something that they had to complete you know in order to for you guys to be able to come into union because this person can't come into union with you and they still married to someone else and i feel like that was something that was hidden with the moon here i feel like that was something they hid from you was this marriage that they had and i feel like once this person gets this divorce that's going to be something that they're going to want to reveal to you guys then we have the Seven of Cups here. You guys have been dealing with the Cancer here. I have Air Energy, Water Energy. Here, Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. We have Seven of Cups. Remember we had here 
many options. So I feel like this person in the past, when you met this person, they had a lot of options and they didn't know which damn cup to choose. They was like, damn, should I choose that cup? Damn, that, that cup right there look good too. Shit, that cup, go and bring me that cup over here. So it looks like this person was trying to choose all the cups. And some of the cups, you see that snake here, you know, they had some deceptive people they was dealing with all because this person had too many people around them. And I feel like this person was not satisfied. You were the person that they wanted to be with, but they were not satisfied with their choices. Give me more messages for my Scorpios today, spirit. And then we have four of cups. I feel like some of you guys could be bored. You know, or this person is bored. If they're in a relationship with somebody right now, this person is bored. But I feel like this is your energy right now, Scorpios. Maybe you guys, you know, you're not dealing with anyone right now. So it's like you're kind of bored. Just wait for the universe to make a move, you know, sing with somebody or do something. But I feel like this person is trying to let go of these toxic ways. And then we had addictions here. So I feel like all these addictions, these codependent, obsessive energies, whatever it was this person had, this person is trying to let go of those toxic ways. They're trying to let go of those addictions. They're trying to let go of whatever they need to let go of at this time to be able to come towards you guys. Give me some more messages for my Scorpios today, spirit. What messages do you have for my Scorpios? I feel like this person, you know, they were a player. You know, they were in and out of your life. Why? Because they were dealing with other people. So I feel like this person's also trying to let go of those toxic ways. This person's trying to let go of those play ways, their toxic ways, because they know if they come, when they come back in, they got to come back in the right way, Scorpio. Then we have here the two of pentacles. I feel like this person's kind of indecisive. I feel like this person wants to come in like they're juggling. Like, right, damn, I want to... Hit Scorpio up, but then again, you know, I don't know if Scorpio really want to talk to me at this time. So I feel like this person is trying to figure out, you know, how am I going to come in and talk to my Scorpio? I want to communicate, I want to reach out, but like, is Scorpio going to talk to me at this time? This King of Swords, this person is doing a lot of thinking. You got a lot of um, water, I mean, water, Swords on this cup. So this person has do, is doing a lot of thinking. They're trying to figure out, they're trying to think. Logically, they're trying to make a head over heart decision, but I feel like this person, because they miss you guys, it's like they, they got to express their feelings as well. And it was like this person, they struggle, you know, with intimacy. They struggle with being vulnerable to you guys. And I feel like that's why you guys had to possibly walk away or pull back your energy from this person. All right, let's get one moonology card before we close out this reading. Give me a card for my Scorpio before we close out this reading. We have show the world the real you. So I feel like this person now, Scorpio, is is ready to come in and show them the real you. But they know they got to make these changes first, Scorpio. All right, that's all I have, you guys. Please like, share, and subscribe.